Local news for Tuesday the 17th of November. Thanks to Neonatal Trust, a record number of iconic New Zealand landmarks and buildings will be lit up purple alongside international landmarks to join in the campaign for World Prematurity Day today. Carter Statue and Van Rotunda in Carterton will be lit up purple, which is designed to raise awareness of 50 million babies born prematurely worldwide each year. Pongaroa shearer and farmer David Buick has again thrown down the challenge to his fellow, fellow shearing elite with a crushing win over former World and Golden Cheers champions John Kirkpatrick and Gavin Much in winning the Central Hawks Bay Open title in Waipukuro at the weekend. The winning run of Mastered and shearer Adam Gordon also came to an end, beaten by his brother Joseph in the intermediate final. Several protesters were arrested yesterday after they blocked the entrance to Ravenstown Fertiliser Plant in Carterton. Some reportedly chaining themselves to the gates. Hundreds of activists across the country took to Ravenstown and Balance Agronutrients uh, areas for ongoing importation of plundered blood phosphate from Western Sahara. And in sport, the Giants men made it three from three with an 8-0 win over Carpenter at the weekend, while the one Apple women's cricket side lost to Hawke's Bay in the first round of the Shrimpton Trophy. For local news and sport, I'm Brent Gear.